Where's Janelle? Do you know where Janelle is? I wonder what happened to that 12-year-old little girl. Everybody was looking for Janelle. What happened and why? Nearly 37 years after a young girl vanished from her home in Greeley, the trial underway in the Janelle Matthews murder case. Ladies and gentlemen, for 37 years, justice for Janelle has been denied. That change is beginning today. Let's talk about December 20th, 1984. My mom was going to California to visit her family for Christmas, and I had a basketball game that night. My dad dropped my sister off at the choir concert, and he came and watched my game. Janelle needed a ride home, so she hopped in our truck and we took her home. My dad waited until he saw her flick on the light. That was our sign that she made it inside and everything's fine. I came home and you could tell Janelle had been there. I yelled out, hi, Janelle. Janelle, are you there? No answer. I got home probably between 9.30 and 10. Jennifer, do you know where Janelle is? And I said, no, she should be here. Was there anything out of place in the house? Not to me. I'm starting to feel real uneasy. I called the police and told them that my daughter was missing, and they did uncover some footprints. I called home, and he said, I just have to tell you something. We can't find you now. I just had a sick feeling to my stomach. Tell me a little bit about Janelle. Just sweet, bubbly, fun. So kind, so nice. Always seemed to kind of be the life of the party. And you always knew Janelle was around. <laughs> years go by. Five years. 10 years, 20 years, 30 years. The police were working like hell to get this case cleared. We just had to wait 35 years. Janelle was finally found. A bulldozer operator uncovered the bones. More than 20 miles from her old home. I didn't want that to be Janelle. I really wanted to not know. The discovery of her body was not the end of the story. This is Steve Pankey. Pankey is a person of interest in a homicide out of Colorado. I've never met Janelle Matthews. He's run for governor. Never met her, never talked to her. He ran for sheriff. Never heard of Janelle Matthews. He likes to talk. He's a talkative guy. I voluntarily gave my DNA. But he's not a murderer. I want to hear what he has to say about that night. Could you please state your name and spell your last name? Stephen Dana Pankey. When you heard that Pankey was going to take the stand, how did you react? I was so surprised. And CBS 4's Kelly Worthman is watching the trial as it all unfolds and joins us now from the newsroom. You don't often have a person who is being charged with murder to take the stand. I did some things that were wrong. Did you ever think this case would end this way? I didn't. I did not see this coming. We, the jury, find the defendant, Stephen Dana Pankey. 